This time on A Moment of Science, penny pinching. A Moment of Science. Here's a question of burning scientific importance. How high can you stack pennies before they fall over? The answer, it depends. In a perfect universe with perfectly flat pennies that align exactly on top of each other, the stack could go as high as you wish. In the real universe, however, you'll be lucky if you can get them above about a foot or so. Why do they always fall over? It's because of the center of gravity. The center of gravity is the point where all the individual weights average out. The entire stack acts as if the weight were located only at the center of gravity. Since the center of gravity is the average of all those penny weights, it will always be in the middle of the stack. That means the higher you make the stack, the higher the center of gravity goes. This is a problem because a low center of gravity is more stable than a high one. Think about this. Simplify the stack into a solid object. How much easier is it for a longer 2x4 board to tip over than a short one? In order to stay standing, the center of gravity has to be over the bottom of the stack. If it moves out far enough so that a vertical line going down from that point doesn't hit the bottom, the whole stack falls. Every penny you add gives more wobble, making it more likely the center of gravity will stray outside that above the bottom zone. When it does, crash! I'm Mandy Strife, and this has been A Moment of Science. Science! For more interesting science facts, visit our website at amomentofscience.org.